Hi guys and welcome to Sons of the Forest, the basics of building, brought to you by Smoke and Nully Gaming. So today we'll be looking at doing the frames and the walls for the foundation that we started on. As you can see I'm just going through placing logs, full logs, all around the edges of the foundation. And then we'll go through and fill everything in shortly. I've sped the video up because no one wants to stand here watching me do this. So there you go, that's the outside done. And then we're going to put a full log across the top, all the way around as well. Well, well. While we're doing this, I wanted to say thank you to everyone that has liked and subscribed and that's been following us on both Twitch and YouTube and joined our Discord server. It's been really amazing building the community and getting involved with everyone. It's been absolutely great. So we're going to go through and just put the rest of the framing through the inside. So these are needed to put the supports up for the ceiling or the, the roof. and to actually just close the building in. There we go, so that's all done. So you guys will have noticed that I've done this build four wide and four by five wide. Uh, generally speaking, the maximum length is four wide to open the build up and I'll, I'll show you guys what I mean soon. Um, I have gone five wide if you do this in lines or rows like I've done here you can get away with five wide. And we need some supports and that's a half log. You can also use stone and I'll show you the difference. So those are the half logs as supports. I'll grab a stone. There we go. So for us personally we prefer using stoner supports because you don't lose quite as much space when you're using them. Um, it's not too important in a larger area but when you've got smaller spaces using the stones are definitely a lot easier um, for the characters to walk past. Chuck that one, clear up some space, nice. Now everything's supported and we can actually pull all the logs from the inside and those beams across the top will stay. If you have put beams all the way across and made a grid over the top of that, that won't work. Um, that's why we've only got the lines like that. Right, we'll fill in these walls. Just placing all the logs on top of each other. You can do all of this with stone. You can build the framing, you can do your walls and your floors, everything with stone. Personally, I like the logs. I prefer the look of it. Um, although when you're building castles, the stones are great. And just a reminder to everyone, these videos are just the basics. Um, we will be creating a series where we show you guys all the tricks that we've learned over the um, combined 1400 hours that we've been playing the game. And if you guys are interested in seeing the village that we've built or some of our other builds we do have some older YouTube videos where we've shown some of that stuff or check us out on Twitch when we're live and um, we will actually be doing some streaming in our village again soon. Now with the foundation video I was explaining to you guys about the rocks that might become an issue later on when you're doing your walls. So you guys will see what I mean in a second once I get all this placed. I'll just skip that for a sec. So in the foundation video we were talking about the rocks getting in the way and that you can build sort of through them or over them or around them and that they may become an issue with the walls. And you'll see here I can't place this log down at all. It does not want to go there because there's a rock 
right on the on the frame. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just actually going to pull these planks. Yeah, no, that won't go there. Chuck that log. I'm going to pull these planks. Whoops, don't want to pull that one. I want that one. So now I've pulled that. I'm going to have to pull the rest of it. Put those away. Oh, and the rest. <laughs> We've gone and done it again. That's okay, guys. We'll fix it in a second. Got to pull the rest of these planks up. So like I was explaining in the foundation video, you want all your framing down there for the foundation at the very least because that can cause issues later on in the builds. Things may not line up correctly. Cool. So we've pulled all that up. Going to go place these logs down. There's our foundation frame back together. Pull that one out. And we're just going to make that the wall. And then we've got a bit of an entrance that comes in as well, which is quite neat. Pick up those planks. There we go. Go replank all of those. Awesome. I'll pull this one out. That didn't need to go back there. So let's have a look. We want those logs back. And we're going to fill this in. So that's going to give us a bit of an entrance way into the build. All the way to the top. And close it all the way in. Whoops. Don't want that. Pull that up. Cool. And there we go. That is the framing and the walls done. If you guys found this video helpful, don't forget to chuck us a like and a subscribe. And thank you guys very much for watching.